What's up, everyone? You're watching FIFA America. I'm your host, Jake Landau. Today, we're going to be talking about Tyler Adams and exploring if he has uncovered and unlocked the ancient technology of teleporting. He is all over the pitch, and today we're going to be talking about three specific things that make him so special. Guys, this is a Patreon early exclusive, so if you want to see more videos like this, and if you want to support the channel for as little as $1.50 a month, you can do that on Patreon and see videos like this before they hit YouTube. The first thing that makes Tyler Adams so special is his defensive positioning and awareness. So we're going to watch a few clips that just demonstrate this. The way that he uses space and closes down the ball with his body movement is just insane and it's on another level. Essentially, I've only seen maybe Conte use his body to close down angles like Tyler Adams does, and his recovery speed and ability to close down defenders is just immense. So you'll see here just the way he gets into space and knows exactly where the next pass is going to be. That positioning again just making it seem like he's all over the pitch. This is Alfonso Davies takes him out, sees the heavy touch, and tackles one of the best dribblers and fastest dribblers in the world. Again, Tyler Adams is matching Davies step for step, takes away, Davies makes an insane move there to swim past Adams, but Adams stays with him and keeps him in the corner before winning a header from Sebastian Legette. Now we're in the El Salvador game. Being able to win headers against physical bodies, even though he's under six feet, is another great talent of Tyler Adams. You'll essentially see here that he is a one-man wrecking crew and completely cuts off all of the passing angles for a triangle that's being played. Here is a perfect example, I, I do want to stop this, because it shows exactly how he can close down these angles and really make it seem like the attacker has no options. Every time the attacker looks or tries to play, place a pass, Adams takes one step towards that direction and cuts off the angle for the attacker until he's able to make the tackle. Again, closing down one of the fastest players in Bundesliga Mbabu, being everywhere on the pitch is not just a work rate thing, it's because of his intelligence knowing exactly where to be, where the ball is going to be, and where the likely place is that he needs to put his body is just what makes him one of the best center defensive midfielders in the game today. We're about to talk about his tackling, but that would not be possible without his incredible positioning and IQ. So the next piece we want to talk about is his tackling ability. If you're a center defensive midfielder, if you're a midfielder, if you're a center back, I want you to watch very closely about how he uses his body and how he always makes the exact move he needs to to get the ball and not foul the other player. The other thing that I see very similar pieces to Conte from Chelsea, who is one of the best center defensive midfielders in the game ever, is how he always makes tackles on the player's blind side. So if we stop with Pogba here, Pogba looks back, sees the Tyler Adams, maybe he has some time, but Tyler Adams is always coming from the blind side to try and steal the ball. He's always surprising the attackers and the dribblers with his tackle, and it makes it that much easier for him to steal the ball. If you're a dribbler, if you're an attacker, it might seem like Tyler Adams just comes out of nowhere to take the ball from you. This is one of my favorite plays because it leads to a goal in the Champions League against Juventus. Again, coming from the attacker's blind spot, being able to win the ball when the attacker has no idea that Tyler Adams is coming. So the third piece that we're going to talk about is his intelligence. 
And guys, I want you to remember what type of pass he makes here to Ricardo Pepe. This is the fourth goal that the US scored against Honduras. And then we're going to watch some clips from his Red Bull days. I want you to think about if you've seen this similar pass before, because for me, I think the only player that I've ever seen purposely chip balls like this to get his passes on is Mezit Ozu. And Ozil was one of the best passers to ever grace the game. The fact that Tyler Adams is already adding this to his arsenal and the passes that he makes are just incredible. He really doesn't get enough credit for this. Now we're going to take a look about his intelligence and just the way he can find passes into the attacking third. This is why everyone is screaming for him to play that middle of the park role for the US because he just does not stop running. He finds the forward pass always and he's just such an engine for the rest of the team. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video about Tyler Adams. I really enjoyed making it and finding all these clips. If you want to see videos like this early and support the channel for as little as $1.50, you can find the Patreon page in the description below. Otherwise, I hope everyone has a great rest of your week.